Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Flying Around the Universe. We've been to many places in our own galaxy in previous episodes. If you haven't seen them, go watch them now so you're all caught up. Also click the damn like button, otherwise I'll murder some puppies. Okay, just kidding. I would never murder puppies. Kittens I would though. Because cats are planning to take over the earth and enslave the humans. Anywho, we are going to stay local in this episode, starting here, moms. This is Earth's next door neighbor. But you wouldn't just go over and borrow a cup of sugar from them, as they are 34 million miles from Earth. Some Earth billionaires will probably be first to land on Mars and start digging for oil or something. Let's go see another planet, big one, Jupiter. But as it's quite dangerous to get too close, we'll warp over to one of its moons a safe distance away. We can't go warp 15 today, as we're just hopping around our own star system. So we'll stick to warp eight or so. Just passing by some of Jupiter's moons. Approaching Io, which is really lazy naming if you ask me. Io is the innermost and third largest of the four galleon moons of the planet Jupiter, slightly larger than Earth's moon. It's the fourth largest moon in the solar system, has the highest density of any moon, the strongest surface gravity of any moon, and the lowest amount of water of any known astronomical object in the solar system. It was discovered in 1610 by Galileo Galilei, and was named after the mythological character Io, a priestess of Hera who became one of Zeus's lovers. But I still think Galileo just picked two random letters from the alphabet. Hello, I'm actor Jonathan Frakes from Star Trek. Be sure to like and subscribe to Scott's excellent channel. Look there, a little blue dot, Earth.
Jupiter is the fifth planet from the Sun and the largest in the solar system. It is a gas giant with a mass more than two and a half times that of all the other planets in the solar system combined, and slightly less than one one thousandth the mass of the Sun. Jupiter orbits the Sun at a distance of 520 AU, with an orbital period of 11.86 years. Jupiter is the third brightest natural object in the Earth's night sky, after the Moon and Venus, and it has been observed since prehistoric times. It was named after Jupiter, the chief deity of ancient Roman religion. Let's go see Jupiter's neighbor, Saturn. A jewel of our star system with its intricate rings. It is a gas giant with an average radius of about nine and a half times that of Earth. It has only one eighth the average density of Earth, but is over 95 times more massive. Also, its rings are very pretty. Let's go fly through the rings. Here we go. That's all for another episode. Thanks so much for watching. And remember the like button. And remember the kittens. I haven't baked kitten pie in so long. <laughs>